Hello everybody and welcome back to Kino Gertoon and Minecraft. I'm Mischief Wow. Uh now if my voice is sounding like echoey or whatever, I'm sorry, I don't know why it's doing that. I've tried fixing it and I haven't been able to figure out how. But yeah, let's start. It was in the last video, the echoing, so hopefully it won't do it this video. I just started in the spawn because why not? Nothing changed though here. And here we are on the spot, and the power is currently off. Um, but yeah, there's a few different things that I need to kind of explain or change it. Uh, first of all, this machine is fixed. It no longer spits out um, an extra item when you turn on the power. But it's always on. That was the problem. Uh, flicking on the power would activate the redstone, like power the redstone lamp which would in turn power the block above it. I didn't really think about it. So, we had to remove that feature, unfortunately. And moving on. Um, this, unfortunately, is still out of order. I will get to that eventually. Uh, here we have the MP5K for now. It's just free. I will change that. It would not be able to fit here, but... Yeah. Uh... So now we head on into the theater, now that I just need to cover up. But you may notice that I have the curtain now, which I will get to in a second. We also have the M16. So if I throw an item down there, ironically, a bow, and I fail, like a champion. You hear a piston if I have my audio recording correctly. And out comes your M16. Uh, I know in the game it's over here, but due to just making it easier, I decided to put it over here. Now here we have the power switch. I don't think the sign was in the last video. Um, sorry about that, I checked to fix it. There was a little hole in the curtain. Um, but yeah, the curtain, I will, I guess I'll just show you what happens when you turn on the power. And yeah, uh, these two are still left here. Um, it's kind of a little buggy, but it's meant to look like, you know, um, what's it called? It's meant to look like the curtain's been pulled to the sides. It's the best I could come up with. Um, I'm definitely going to uh, tweak it a bit. Uh, don't even ask about the chest. It's supposed to be a book that like explains something if the floor doesn't rebuild itself, but the texture pack I have currently doesn't show books. Um, so yeah, the floor is a cobblestone generator, and I just textured the cobblestone to look like stone bricks, which is why now the levers look like stone bricks instead of cobblestone, in case you were wondering. Uh, now I also changed these. They actually look like seats now. It was recommended by my one friend. Uh, I don't think he... We we did an old channel together, but he doesn't have a channel now, so whatever. Um, I fixed it up, so it kind of looks like chairs, you know, different colored wood rotting. I left the chandelier because it's actually in the game. And you may notice this light pulsing on and off. I just have a random weirdish repeater to make it look like a flickering light. I don't think this is in the game, but I just thought it would be cool and the cracked cobble to make it look like, I guess this fell off or something? I don't know why I do things sometimes. Um, but yeah, there's no real major, major changes to the game. Or the map, sorry. Um, yeah, if you're wondering how this worked, this is sand textured, textured to be, um, red wool, you'll see it's sand. I also fixed the texture pack so that the creative inventory doesn't look messed up. But yeah, this is sand. So it has gravity, and basically what it does is it pulls a bunch of signs connected to each other, so all the sand falls, and then the cobblestone generator fixes the floor. I also added a spawn zombies button for the theater, and now it doesn't stay, but there is a cage spider, which I figured would be closest, closest to the uh, gas zombies or nova crawlers. Now, I don't know what the hell is up with these zombies. Uh, my texture pack must have got a little bit uh, 
messed up, I'll fix those because whoa, he's scary looking. Like he looks like some sort of messed up creeper. I don't know what the hell happened. His head's like, ugh. There's the zombies for his head supposed to be. I don't know what the fuck happened, but yeah, oh, and there's a real creeper. Uh, yeah, hopefully I'll fix it. There's one more thing that I have done, and we'll show you. So you'll see this uh, jukebox here, and the reason is when you go to... I don't know what that is. Maybe it's a mob. Um, when you go to Samantha's room, which is finished now, you can find the button, and it will dispense a CD. Uh, it's the closest I could figure. I thought it would be kind of cool to, like, the film reels in the projector, so you see, you get a CD, there's uh, three different CDs in there, because that's how the should be in the game. Now I just got double teleported to the lobby, I'll have to fix that. Let's see, now I can. Yep. And, yeah, that's about it. Like I said, there isn't any major updates, no new rooms yet. Um, but yeah, I just haven't made a video in a while and I wanted to, you know, do that. There's a random boat in the wall. That's weird. Uh, but yeah, I'm not going to drag this out any longer. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, it helps a ton and keep me going on the YouTubes. I'm th I was thinking about quitting.